Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Twitter. Uh, so today in this video, we will see how we can uh, deploy a website from your Bitbucket account to your Azure. Uh, so uh, first of all, uh, you have to create a repository on your Bitbucket account. So uh, I have created a repository there. And under this repository, there is uh, one file that is index.html file. So uh, we will uh, try to uh, uh, deploy uh, the content of this repository on our Microsoft Azure account. So uh, first of all, uh, log into your Microsoft Azure account, and uh, there you have to create a resource first of all. So we'll click on create a resource. Now uh, we will create a website here. So select the option dev app right so enter the name of your bank here yeah. right so uh, either you can create a uh, new resource group here or you can use the existing one so i am selecting the existing one here and then click on create button Now Azure is uh, validating all the information which is entered here and uh, once it is validated then it will set the deployment. So you can see here on the top that uh, the deployment is in progress so it will take some time. So we have to wait for that. Yes, uh, you can see the message here that uh, deployment is succeeded. Now we will go to resource, click on all resources, and then this one is the web app which we have created. So click on it. Here on the top, there is a URL of the website which we have created. So you can click on it. So you can see here that uh, our new website has been configured with Microsoft Azure but still there is uh, nothing on this website. So uh, we will try to uh, deploy the content from our Bitbucket repository to this uh, particular web app. Uh, so for that again go to your Azure account and you can see on the left side there is an option deployment options so just click on that. Now, uh, first of all, is uh, choose source. So click on that, and there are different sources which you can set for the deployment. Uh, as we are using Bitbucket here, so I will select the Bitbucket. Now, uh, the first one is uh, your project. So, objectives here, that we do. The second is your branch. And then click on OK. So, guys, uh, here you have to uh, make sure that uh, if you are uh, logging first time or you are setting the deployment options, uh, pick bucket uh, for you as you, then make sure that you have to uh, authorize your uh, pick bucket account here. So, if you are setting it the first time and you will click on that, then it will ask your uh, pick bucket credentials. So, you have to enter your pick bucket credentials here. Uh, so finally click on the OK button. So you can see here that the setup deployment shows. So it is fetching and you can see that successfully set up a deployment shows. Okay. Uh, again uh, in deployment options. You can see it is uh, uh, syncing with your big bucket. Uh, account and it is fetching all the uh, files which we have which uh, we have created on our bitbucket repository uh, so building uh, build process is going on here and once it will be done uh, then we can uh, browse the website and uh, we can check our index.html file there 
yes it is done here now you can again click on overview button here and again when you will browse this up website you can see that uh, the content of your index.html page is displayed here so guys using all these steps uh, you can set the big bucket as your deployment options in your microsoft azure account so thanks for watching this video